What's up, you guys? We're here with our beautiful girlfriends. <laughs> and today we're doing a battle of the couples. Yup. We're gonna make this fun and interesting, so it's gonna be a $20 budget at Walmart. Get whatever you can, and we're gonna make it for the other couple. Ooh. So not only are we gonna be judging each other, but you guys are gonna be judging at home. Who's gonna be taking home the gold? Let's find out, let's hit Walmart, come on. Oh wait, but before we go, I wanna point out our brand new merch that's out. If you like that retro look, this is good for anyone in the family. The boyfriend, the girlfriend, the brother, the sister, whatever we may be. I'm not even sure. BrennanTaylor.com, pick something up. Now let's go to Walmart. So we got 10 minutes to get them the perfect meal. Do you have any ideas? Zero. Zero. So let's get on in there and let's hopefully come up with something. Timer has started. Time is running out, but look how awesome our shirts are, by the way. Runandtaylor.com. As you guys know, we only have $20. So what can we really do with $20? I had this one idea where we can get some fish sticks, we can get some tortillas, and we make some like fish tacos. That could be kind of fancy. I think that would be nice. But let's do a quick stroll through. We can through. dress it. Yeah, we'll dress it with some nice stuff. We'll get some coleslaw, maybe. We'll make it look like it's a five-star experience. Mm -hmm. Fish sticks, we got literally $3. That's within our budget. That's good bang for our buck. Oh, shit. If we wanted to, we could do a calamari appetizer. Look, we can also do a dessert, like a Twinkie or something. We, we, Poison them? We are on a budget. No, we're not desperate. <laughs> $1.68, they're warm, literally like they just came out of some kind of oven. So with just these two items, we're at like literally under $10 still, so we're doing good. We still got another $10 to play with, so now we're gonna find what we could pair with this. Here's canned beans if we wanted to do that, but I just feel like that's kind of a weird combo. Not according to Google. Google's always right. Okay. All right, anything else? Do we want beans? If we have to get rid of them when we're checking out, that's when we'll get rid of them. And their dessert. Boom, look at that. 20 bucks, we're making it happen. Look at that, we got change to spare, baby. We're gonna eat big after this. I can't wait. And look at that, you get three full gumballs, baby. Three full gumballs. That's an hour on the meter. All right, y'all are up. Good luck. Let me see the receipt, $20? It's $20, yes. we literally, you wanna see? I'll show you, I'll show you. $20 only. I'm holding the rest. $20, good luck, guys. You can take it all, I'm just taking my ID. There you go. Wow. Hey, shop listings allowed, right? Hey, no, 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 no. It's our time to go. I have so. an idea, so we're gonna go try that out. So my first idea is to hit the clearance aisle like they have at like markets, but I don't know if they're gonna have that here. Second option would be like rotisserie chicken, but they also don't think they have those here. So we might be a little bit out of luck, but we gotta get going. We gotta, why are we by the microwaves? What is the <laughs> point? There's no hot chickens. Wrong way. <laughs> this is all the food they have. This place sucks. There's no way. Brian, message for you. Why, why did you pick this spot? <laughs> so what I think to do is like a chicken Alfredo. We can buy the can of Alfredo sauce. Look, 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 fast. shrimp. Shrimp Alfredo. <laughs> Cheap wine. <laughs> wow. What a That's steal. A what a hangover in a glass, eh? <laughs> Ooh. There you go, sir. Oh, we did it. Under $20. Hide the bag. $19 and two pennies. Okay, get in. Let's go try this. Let's do it. So we just got back from Walmart. This is the appetizer. So we got some calamari. We're going off of this fish type style. Huh? So then that's the appetizer. For the main course, we're gonna have some fish tacos, which we're gonna accompany with some tartar sauce, some beans, and some rice. And for dessert? Something light. Something light. Boom, bada bing, bada boom. We got a Hershey's chocolate bar. So let's get started. We gotta plate this as nice as we can, and hopefully we take the gold. Fingers crossed. I don't know what this fucking was. <laughs> and hopefully we take the gold. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Okay, let's do this. First things first, gotta preheat the oven. Wow, it takes two minutes. 12 minutes. <coughs> microwavable rice. Yeah. Is it microwavable? You know what we need time. to do first? What? Wash our hands. Smart thinking. So let's see how these actually look, shall we? Okay, I mean, that's like perfect for what we're going for. Oh, it comes with its own sauce. Ooh. Wow, nice. okay. I mean, that's 
should be fine, right? Yeah, but I think I might want to have a few of these. Maybe we'll get hungry one day <laughs> and we'll want just like five of these. So let's put them in the freezer. <laughs> so we got their meal plated nicely. We're going to throw it in the oven. We got their appetizers and the main course all here, done right now, basically. So let's throw it in there and we wait. So while the stuff's in the oven, why don't you show people how to start making the rest of the meal? My turn? Yep. <clears throat> you open your can of beans. <sighs> it kind of looks like cloudy water. Not Yum. appetizing. Only 98 cents though. Now, you empty the bean water in the sink and now you pour your beans. To the pan. And let there be light! Now that the beans are being cooked, let's start preparing the rice. So it says that these could be made in the microwave or on the uh, stove top, but we're just gonna use the microwave. Mm. Mm -mm. Look at that t-shirt, y'all. Pick one up right here. That's the link. Alright, that's a lot of water in there, guys. We did it, we did it. So now that everything is being cooked, now we wait, we'll serve it up, and we pray. In any kitchen, the chef always gets to try the food first. So let us know how it is. Mm. Do they taste like $6? I got it. Perfect. Mm. So we're gonna grab something that we didn't buy, but please don't tell Jake. We're gonna use some lemon juice, lime juice. Since we have a three course meal, we're gonna call them over to try the appetizer, then we're gonna send them away while we prepare the main course. Jake, Kira? We need to hide the dessert. Oh, hide it, hide it, hide it. Your appetizer, please, come. Come, the appetizer is here. Some gourmet calamari. Oh. Please, let us know. Drizzled with the slightest lime juice, just to enhance the flavors. What's in the middle? Some dipping sauce. I need tomato sauce. Mmm. Pretty good? Pretty good. I will say they are not that good. <laughs> hey man. But they're not bad. They're seven dollars. They're not bad. Yeah, this sauce. All right. Let us try. Yeah. Is this kind of like a marinara sauce? Hmm. I would like them a little more crispy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But a little chewy. So far so good. Now get out of our kitchen while we prepare the main dish. You hear that? You know what that means, right? Food's ready. Now let's put this all together and let's make something amazing. Oh, it worked, baby. It worked. Oh God, it's gonna fall out, okay. We're gonna place a stick or two on both. Should we, should we munch them? I don't know, do you think? It might make it look less like the fish taste. That just looks like mush now. It looks great, it looks great. Wait, 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 wait. Last but not least. Mm. Welcome to the main course. Please, come, come, come one, come all. What we have here is a gourmet fish taco. Okay. We got rice, we got beans, and these beans were picked from a nice little town in Puerto Rico. So I hope you guys enjoy them, please. Go for it. Did you even heat the tortilla? Yeah, of course we did. With the gomal in the back. <laughs> did you put lemon on it? Of course we did. Okay. Same time. Same time. time. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cheers. Mm. Not bad. I think the beans are a little bit hard. Really? I didn't notice. It doesn't have a whole lot of flavor. Working with what we got here, guys. I taste the fish out of everything in it, though. Good. Which is good. Yeah, like the fish doesn't fish taste tacos. bad. Fish tacos. I'm going in for a second bite, so it's not a bad thing. That's a good mm -hmm. sign. I'm not bad at it. Nice. No. Nice. Not at all. What did you guys season it with? Love. <laughs> Just lots of love. And kindness. And kindness. That's so sweet. This is like something from like Del Taco. 
Okay, hey! For two people An in the kitchen. An established restaurant. Yeah, hey, it's not like he said this is like something from Walmart. He right. said no taco. <laughs> they have one more thing, so please step out while we bring out your dessert. <gasps> dessert? Yep. Okay. It's a three course meal. <laughs> Guys, we messed up. We messed up. We forgot <laughs> to put the damn tartar sauce in it. Damn it! It is what it is. It is what it is. Let's make their dessert now. A delicious cheese bar. Perfect. With almonds. With almonds. Let's crack that thing open. How should we eat? I'm thinking, how should we make it? Let's see if one bar is on blocks, huh? E. How do you make it look fancy? Leave it like that. <laughs> dessert has been served. Please, I'm scared. come, come. For dessert, straight from Germany, we have a Hershey's bar with almonds. Are there any nut allergies you should be aware of? No. Perfect. But there's uh, dairy. <laughs> well, I'm lactose intolerant. the merch, BrandonTaylor.com. Go ahead. I was thinking to do it like Lady and Tramp style, but hey, you guys do what you need to do. do that. Well, oh my god. <laughs> For the whole meal, I'll give you a 5-3. I'll give you a 5-5, five, five, just to be nice. Sweet! <laughs> we'll take it. What do you guys <laughs> judge at home? <laughs> Let us know in the comments down below. But now, the kitchen is yours. Make us proud. We will. Alright! <laughs> Get out of my kitchen! Alright, it is our turn. And after eating their amazing <laughs> meal, it's time to cook ours. Let's do this. We have... A one course meal. <laughs> one course is all you need when you have this couple making it. So here we go, let's get this going. All right, so the water is boiling right now. While we wait, we just finished our bread, but we're gonna put that off to the side. Hopefully it doesn't harden too fast. I don't know how bread works, but put it over there. It's getting there. And while that's going, we're gonna drop these bad boys in. And uh, the Taylor family has a hard time of uh, rationing portion sizes, so we're making dinner for four right now. <laughs> it shows what $20 can really do. Not just get you a Hershey bar and some Puerto Rican pinto beans. Going in. I'm just going for it. Usually when I cook, I never put enough spice, so I'm gonna go a little overboard. Oh! -ho! <laughs> ben Paka, come here! Ooh, oh, damn! Woo! I smell it. Oh yeah! Do you smell that seasoning? Cause I do. We're putting these in at 400 degrees. No idea for how long, <laughs> but we're figuring it out. Is that ranch? <laughs> Honestly, the color is like not that appetizing. That's... I think you like take a fork and go like this. And then you plate it. Yeah. yeah. So I'm using this pitchfork, sticking it in here, spinning it around. <laughs> Don't have my assistant helping me right now, so I gotta use my elbow. No mamas, no mamas. <laughs> wow! Wow! Whoa! <laughs> Dude, I don't, I don't even want to touch him. Whoa, whoa! Be careful with my creation, okay? Okay. Careful, careful. This is a art. this is Picasso of food right now. Picasso. I know. Who knew I was as talented? I'm mad that. We're doing them so good. Like we are doing you and you both so good. And you treated us with the disrespect of a fish stick <laughs> at a Hershey bar. Love you, but I also hate you. You guys ready? Yeah. Come on in. Alright. Oh my goodness. Wow. Today we made you fettuccine Alfredo with shrimp. Got you some ciabatta bread that's garlic and um, Parmesan. Parmesan cheese on it. 
Wow. And a nice glass. And a nice glass of wine. Chardonnay. Oh. <laughs> Our fish tacos ain't looking too good right about now. <laughs> and uh, this wine was two dollars and ninety eight cents. Ah, oh, that perfect hangover. Came, it, that's what I said. Came right into well, our budget. Let's try this. Nice, very mm. sugary. Mm. All right, I mean, this looks great. It smells good. But I mean, from the look of it, it looks like these noodles are about to be al dente. So <laughs> let's try them. Oh, he's, he's gonna make it build a sandwich. I'll build a little sandwich. Damn good. I don't know was fish tacos. <laughs> Man, I didn't know you can get gourmet for twenty dollars. Man, I'm gonna go for my money. <laughs> okay, so I mean, look, I wish I would have thought of pasta. It didn't even cross my mind. The only thing that passed my mind was fish tacos. So let's throw in our ratings. Be honest. I'm gonna give this motherfucker eight point seven. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say eight. This is so good. <laughs> You guys did good. But wait, what do you guys think in the comments down below? Who had the better date meal? This just comes to show that you can eat good for 20 bucks. Yeah. We showed you different sides of the spectrum. Walmart has it. I think you guys are gonna have to decide. No, and we literally used everything that we bought from Walmart besides of like spices. Spices. Yeah. Which every household usually has spices. You know, garlic salt. Good work. Good work. So that's that guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did and you want to see more videos like this, leave a comment down below. Let us know if you want to see some more couple battle offs. We can do different things. You guys let us know if you have any suggestions down below. Hit the thumbs up on this video. Hit the subscribe. Pick up the merch, brennantaylor.com. And until next time, we'll see you guys later. Peace. I'm falling for the girl next door. Been through hell and back. That's why she don't get attached. I'm falling for the girl next door. I'm falling for the girl next door Everybody wants